Continuing on with extensor carpi ulnaris, its origination point is the lateral epicondyle running down the side of the forearm here, attaching to the base of the fifth metacarpal. It does extension of the wrist as well as a bit of ulnar deviation, so we'll bring them up into the test position here. So hold there nice and strong while stabilizing. Make sure you stabilize right across this fifth metacarpal to make it specific. So what we can see is the outline of that muscle when it comes up right here underneath my finger. And we're going to see a nice differentiation of all these muscle fibers. So now extend your little finger and move it around. You can see extensor digiti minimi directly on top of it contracting while he moves his finger. And I just have a static muscle test of the extensor carpi ulnaris right beneath my finger here. Now go ahead and move all four fingers and wiggle them. And now you can see extensor digitorum sitting directly on top of that. Really, really nice definition through this forearm here. You can see the separate divisions, but how they're all very tightly packed together. And relax.